Hello viewers and welcome back to Invisible Ink. So, last episode I went through the tutorial uh, in a, just a quick short video to show you guys what the game is. Um, I didn't want to basically show too much of the game in the first video, um, just in case people went, oh, I don't like this and didn't have to sort of... Well, I suppose you could have just stopped instead of watching through the whole video. But anyway, let's get this series going properly with the next mission. So first off, I want to have a look at the... Uh, stats here. So we have Deckard and International. I think I'm pronouncing that correct. Um, so we have Brian Deckard, service 21 years, status active. Uh, he's good at stealth. Two points in stealth, one in hacking, one in inventory, and one in anarchy. Uh, I don't know what these two do yet, but we'll see. Uh, he has the special ability stealth, years of practice, makes this agent a great master of movement, of his own movement. So we have a neural disruptor and a Modded cloaking rig. Deckard's personal cloaking rig renders the user invisible for a turn. Can't be used while being watched by an enemy. Hate him cool down. Uh, so he's kind of cool. Uh, as I said in the last episode, Deckard is the name of a very famous sci fi character. Um, and then we have International, real name Maria International Valds. A service eight years, status active, with huge headset for uh, no apparent reason. Um, not so good at stealth, only one point. Good at hacking, uh, inventory and anarchy, I have no idea. And she has a, wi a wireless interface. A powerful broadcasting device interacts with electronics from a distance, even through walls. Scan electronics and access computers in five tiles away. Uh, she also has a neural disruptor. Uh, and then there's two other characters which are currently classified. Um, presumably there's going to be more as the game gets better, as the game gets more improved. So we'll see. So we have also got these incognita programs. Uh, we have power dip, uh, drip sorry, generates one power point per turn and then lock pick one is what we saw before, breaks one firewall for two power and then we have a bunch of classified ones as well. Okay lastly, uh, so I have easy neural disruptor, knocks out for longer, firewalls are weaker, alarm stages are less dangerous, safe subjects and guards have more credits and neural disruptors uh, have a shorter uh, knockout period, fellows stronger alarms, blah blah blah, so basically the opposite. I'm going to keep it on easy for now, I've heard this game is quite hard, and I'm not terrible at games, but if you've seen my uh, XCOM playthrough, which was on classic difficulty, I will admit it was on classic difficulty, difficulty which is like the hard to the impossible. Um, I'm going to keep it on easy for now. Oh, let's go to normal. Screw it, let's go normal. Um, if I fail horribly, you can watch me fail horribly. Uh, <laughs> anyway, so let's head off the first official proper mission. Begin. So, welcome to Invisible Lake. You are about to embark on a hardcore procedurally generated stealth game. Oh yes, I forgot to mention last episode. Uh, this game is procedurally generated, which means that each playthrough should be different compared to um, XCOM, which does have... Well, I suppose it's similar to XCOM in that it generates which missions you do in a random order with a random seed. Gen generates the map. Uh, which map you play on differently. Um, okay, this means you... Uh, yeah, okay. You have 72 hours to prepare for your final mission. Choose location to infiltrate and build up your team and rewards. How you play is completely up to you, but be forewarned, this world is unforgiving. If your agents expire, they are gone for good. Can your agents survive and uncover the secrets of invisible ink? I am ready. Day 1, 72 Welcome hours, remember. Welcome Operator. Incognito is picking up some strange patterns in the global market. We don't hmm. know what it all means yet, but it's accelerating. We should prepare for a major action in the coming days. This won't be easy. Our resources are stretched thin. I've lined up some lucrative contracts and targets of opportunity that we can exploit to better our position. Okay. I'll let you choose the missions as you see fit, but be careful. We can't afford another setback right now. Acknowledged. So, we have... Uh, Brasilia, Mombasa, Singapore, Seoul, and Christchurch. Uh, I want to go to see the nice Le Corbusian architecture of Brasilia. Um, travel time, 10 hours. And we're based in Switzerland, I guess that is. Uh, travel time, 10 hours. KO, security dispatch. Security level guarded. Very guarded. 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 Very guarded. Uh, actually, let's go to Mombasa because it's a short. Oh, it's very good. Let's go to Brasilia. Infiltrate. 
Operator, we found a useful vulnerability. The satellite network has no visibility in this sector. Huh. This is a training facility for new security staff. You may okay. be able to steal some unlicensed armaments. Excellent. Keep low profile, and this should be profitable. Okay, let's start this mission. Uh, I'm a little nervous to see how this goes, but uh, let's go ahead and start. Okay, locating agents. Connecting established. Synchronizing. Okay, the corporation. Inc uh, blah, 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 blah. The corporation increases uh, security alarm systems. The corporation has detected incognito synchronizing with your agents. Their automated system is hacking through incognito's encryption and assessing their threat. The longer you stay here, the more security is going to send to stop you. So time is of essence. Oh, great. Right, let's make this profitable. Remember, your agents are good, but not bulletproof. Get as much as you can and get out of there. Okay, Deckard. Uh, actually, let's get... Let's peek around the corner. Not seeing anything there. Looks like we're clear to move forward. Incognito, go forwards. Not incognito. International, go forwards. Uh, and then peek around that corner too. Okay, it looks like we're in a, a room. Yeah, we've got pillars around to show us what's going on. Deckard, move out. Peek around that corner too. Okay. Uh, I think I'm going to go for this door first. Let's enter. Alarm level increased. Cool, we saw that before. Okay, let's peek through this door and see what's there. Uh, okay, we have to find the elevator and I don't know what that does. But we're also kind of wanting to steal stuff. Our objective is to find the elevator, but I I don't know quite what that means. Let's move Deckard forward. I want to peek around this door in a second. International! Uh, for now, I want you to move into the left. Escape. Escape to the next level. Um, I still want to have a look around before I go. Alarm increase. Aha, we're hearing people move. Let's have a peek around. I think these are movements of guards. Oh, security camera off. Whew, phew. Uh, that door is locked, it needs a passcode. I don't know if that's two guards or one. I think it might be one. No, I think it's two. For now, however, let's move International forwards, and we will peek around that corner next turn. Dakar has got 7 AP left. I feel like I should do more with him. I could move around here. Hmm. I can move to there and peek through the door. That's... Aha! Okay, we can hijack with power. Let's peek inside here. That is a guard. Okay, end turn. Our alarm level's gonna go up. Okay, he's... Power drip's gonna give us more power. Uh, international, you can hijack from a range. Move to that door and peek through. Okay, we see a guard there. We need to move forwards. Deckard, get in position. I want you to... International does have the ability to open the door. I want you to prepare a melee reaction. Then International, open the door. And we're going to end our turn. So this guard's going to walk forwards. The corporation is activating additional cameras. You have one turn before they're fully activated. Oh bugger, that might be that one. So we're going to take out that guard. Let's take out that camera before it turns on. 
Um, let's drag the body slightly out of the way and then drop the body and search with our one SP. Oh, we have a pass card, excellent. And steal credits. Incognita. Uh, move in, not incognita. Ah. She can't peek through the door right this turn. Um, but we can open this door in a second. So he's going to wake up soon. End turn. Alarm increase. Um, Dakard, get through the door. And close it behind us. We can't lock the door because it doesn't have a lock on. We can peek through this door. Um, hijack to get some power. So you can move that. Open the door. And let's take a look inside. This room is pointless. But Deckard, um, let's move. I want to move to here. And I want to peek through the door. Advanced technology detected. Let's unlock the door. Get inside. Close the door behind us. We're going to close that door as well and end our turn. Just so that if this guy wakes up, we can uh, we can get some advanced warning of it. Let's move forward. Uh, unlock the safe, safe using incognito. Unlock. There we go. And we have one up there too. Oh, there's lots on this floor. Excellent. Search the cupboard safe. 120 pounds. Our EMP pack one. Oh, my inventory is full. Uh, upgrade inventory in the field for some cash. So that guard's going to wake up soon. That's not so good. He's probably going to come through this door too. Uh, let's move him there. International. Don't have a pass card. You can hack. Uh, okay, let's keep, leave her there for now. Let's see what this guard does when he wakes up. That's where he was knocked out, more or less. Uh, I want to peek through this door. Whoa, that's a huge cannon. Scan for new made with devices. Uh, let's try and hack. Hack power supply, hack security camera. Let's get rid of the camera and the power supply. Uh, so that turret is currently off. It can't turn on because I've turned the power off. We can have unlock this door. Open the door. Take cover inside. And close the door. Uh, if we move incognito down, oh god, no, that was a bad move. Oh, uh, we can still, we can still Overwatch. Okay, end turn. This game the area. Point of interest. Okay. So really, we want to go up here. We kind of want to take out that guard first, but then we want to go up here and see if we can steal these two things. Uh, okay. He's going to probably go move down there. Unfortunately, we need to kind of go through that space to get to where he is. What Deckard could do is move around here and prepare a melee reaction. International has to stay where she is because there's a guy right at the door. All files increase per strength plus one. Okay, that's a problem. Uh, International, however, can come 
open this door. Come behind this guard. Take him down. Uh, can we actually lock him in a room? I think we can lock him in a room. Let's drag his body. Oh, uh, we have to... Yeah, okay. Let's get Deckard up here. I'm going to lock him in this room, I think. This is probably not the best uh, time to be pissing about. Oh, she's going to take ages to drag him. He might actually wake up before we finish dragging him. That would be bad. <laughs> this is quite... Uh, this is a bad plan. We're kind of wasting a lot of time here. Okay, he doesn't he doesn't reset until close door. Oh, Deckard can't. Oh, I thought you could lock the door. It's because I've unlocked it already. Damn it! Oh well, we we can't we can't waste any more time. We really have to get uh, really have to get going. Put one more guard on the building. Okay. Oh God, he's right there. Uh, and there's someone watching. Notice this area is noticed by the enemy. Uh, let's use the cloak. Get him out of there. In fact, can I stand here and ready a uh, melee reaction? Yes, I can. It's going to have to be the end of our turn. Alarm level 3, we take him down. That guy's going to wake up. Uh, let's... Get international out there. She can't be around when that guy gets out of that room. Deckard, um. Can I search him? No, I can't search him. Let's peek through this door. What's that? Console database. Hack security camera. Let's get rid of that security camera. So both those security cameras are done. We can access that database, don't know what that does. Nanofabricator, done. Uh, okay, the guard's going to run to there. We don't have a... Okay, we can now open that door, though. And... No, we don't want to do that. We want to keep that door closed for now. End turn. Let's see what happens. Alarming increasing. That guy's going to wake up soon. We need to get out of here. The problem is that the lift is there. We could just run for the lift now and escape, and accept that we've only gotten a small amount of cash. Or we could go... Okay, that room's being watched. I'm not sure there's anything in there that I want anyway. Take cover up here. Close this door. Uh, for now, she's going to have to stay there. She doesn't really have enough points to move anywhere useful. Okay, that guy's gone in there. Let's move to the console database. And move... 
international out the way too. This guard's going to come through and he probably won't see us. But let's try and get some power. Oh, I can't from this distance. Okay, let's enter and see what happens. Alarming increasing. Uh, power supplies are there. Let's take out this guard. Uh, no, I don't want to drop. I want to take him down. Steal from him. Uh, we've already got a pass card. We want to steal his credits. And then let's peek through this door. We have a power supply watched by um, watched by the enemy. So that means there's probably a turret there. We'll hack. Get rid of the turret. Um, I'm actually going to open the door. Oh, there's a camera there. Can we hack the camera? Uh, not enough power to hack the camera. Let's close the door. This guy's going to wake up soon, so that's going to be a problem. Uh, end turn. Ah, okay. One of the guards is going to come in here. That's scarily close. Alarm level 4. The corporation called One Elite Forces. Enforcers, be careful. These guys are fast and dangerous. Uh, okay, let's get out of here now. This is starting to become a problem. Oh, that's their elite guy. That's their elite enforcer. Uh, shit. We need to leave. We need to leave now. Let's get Deckard out of the way. Uh, and turn. Guard overwatch. A guard has been is about to shoot your agent. Your agent can quickly hide behind cover with one square. Or can send another agent to give support. Uh, I'm about to get shot. Screw it, let's run. Deckard, no! Agent down. This is a disaster. No! Okay, so this is definitely harder than I thought. <laughs> no! Oh dear. Um, okay, so the first mission I killed both of my agents, and it didn't go so well. I gained 800 experience though. Uh, final score was 519, which is the uh, maximum amount of cash that I got. Okay, well, <laughs> that was the first. <laughs> that was the first mission of this playthrough. Did not go so well. So next episode we'll uh, we'll give that another go. Uh, I just checked how much footage we've got, and um, yeah, that's an episode. Well, thank you very much for watching, and I hope you enjoyed, and I will see you next time, where we will try to fail less. Anyway, goodbye. <laughs>